Hey everybody, this is Miss J again. I am creating another tutorial for how to code the flash banner. Um, I showed you previously how to design one. Um, this is a finished product that I have right now. It's showing up here. Uh, just basically, just gonna teach you how to actually go about coding it. Um, go, you can go back if you have you created yours or whatever. So go ahead and go back to it, check it out. Um, we can go back and check ours again. Hit back, hit and Control Enter. It'll bring it up, and here's our. This is called our SWF file, which actually shows the animation. And if you have um, Adobe Flash Player already installed on your computer, the updated version, then somebody can send you a SWF file, and you automatically just get it. Click on it, and you can view it. It just doesn't bring you the code. Now, if you have the FLA file, this gives you everything as far as how to do everything. I have not how to do everything, but basically what somebody did, how they did it, and just stuff like that. It also gives you, you know the code. You can still click on the code, check it out, and all that. So um okay um so what we'll do is since I hit Control Enter, it automatically saves on my computer as an SWF file. Now remember, you have to remember where you saved your file at. So I hit I have file and you know it's already saved. So if you haven't saved it, go ahead and save it again if you're done with it completely. So now, um, what I do is I would go to webs.com. All right. Now I'm gonna and then log it off to show you all. Um, webs.com is where I go to to actually upload my SWF files. Now, if you don't have a free webs account. That's fine. Let's go ahead and create one. But like I said, this is what I use. You might know somebody else, or you might have your own .com. That's fine too. But this is what I use as of right now. So um, you can start off by just putting in your little site address, and you know, just put in something. Put in something of mine, and then just go down and create a create a password, and then you hit create a website. Now I don't want you to come back and be like, well, I didn't see create a website or something didn't go on right and nothing. No, I'm showing you exactly what you need to do to actually get to this part right here so you can be done with creating your actual thing. So you come here and you put in all your information in and everything like that. And you can either do the you know, advanced HTML mode, which is fine. Or you can just pick out one of the templates, which is also fine. I don't use this for any of my websites or anything like that. I just use them to basically to save. Save SWF files. Uh, <clears throat> the reason is because I don't want people to know my .com as a misjinc.webs.com, but um, the website is coming soon. I'm just still working on it, and uh, of course, everybody will get the heads up on that when it comes. Then, after you fill out all the information, you can go down here to I agree, and then you create the site. Now, since we're done with that, we will. Um, Go back to home so I can log in and show you all exactly what I do. All right, so I go here. You can, if you after you've created it, just come back here and log it in. Um, logged in, and then I go to my file manager. So you got a site manager which shows everything that you have. Basically, you know, it's a draft or whatever. It can be a little confusing at first, but you know, you'll get into it. After the more you get here, so I go to my file manager, and this is where it will show me all of my SWF files that I've had for basically all my clients and everybody like that and all that stuff. So what I would do, I would go to single file uploader. Now this is where you would find your um, actual SWF file that we just created. So you go to browse and go to wherever it is located at um let's see oh, where's mine's at <laughs> you know this is okay um and you have to make sure that you select the one that looks just like this cuz of course you can tell this is the FL file or FLIE file and this is the the one that looks just like this is the SWF file that's your flash movie like completed project so this is what you click on. This is what you want to be presented on your MySpace or whatever web page. So you go here. You can either, you know, if you already have these up here, that's fine. I might create one anyway. So you know what? Go ahead and 